And we begin with new details this morning. Now, the search for this missing eagle toddler resumed this morning. Rory Pope has been missing since noon yesterday in the area of West Nordic Drive in Eagle. Our Chase Biefeld is on the scene for us this noon hour. Chase, so what can you tell us about the search efforts at this point? Well, Doug, right now I'm in the Legacy subdivision at near Lakeside Retreats here in Eagle, where crews have been searching this pond all morning. They are not in the water actively searching right now, but we do have video of that. We're going to bring that up and show you that. Police have worked their way around the perimeter of the pond, and earlier they even deployed a sonar drone to kind of scout out the surface of the pond. That drone has since been taken out of the water, and we do not have word from police on if they've found anything of interest in the pond yet. If you're just now hearing about this story let's catch you up right now rory pope was last seen yesterday around noon in this neighborhood right here legacy subdivision in eagle rory is a white two-year-old and has curly blonde hair Ada County Sheriff's Office says there is no evidence that Rory was abducted. Police are also searching another nearby body of water just over these houses right here. We'll check that out too. Um, police will uh, they will continue searching this area today, and I will give you the latest update in this search for Rory at the top of the 4 o'clock hour. Doug? Boy, just really hoping that this all turns out well. Chase, thank you very much. We'll look to your reporting um, on the news at 4. Now, we do want to mention that the sheriff's office says they do not need any other volunteers to help with the search. But if you happen to see Rory, we want you to know that these are the clothes he is wearing because this picture was taken just yesterday morning. See, it looks like blue shorts and a lime green shirt. There's that curly blonde hair Chase mentioned. If you have any information, you are asked to call 911. We have more information on our website, ktv.com. And again, check back in the news at 4 for the latest on this search. So while searching Reddit, I found this Brian's prediction. It says Brian Lad Psychic. I know a lot of people may not be into it, but since I'm following this case, I thought I would just cover it just in case, eh? So it says Rory Pope opened 9 to 20. Uh, missing child Rory Pope found was not the way it happened. Look under the car mats for proof. The algae in the car matches cove. Schizophrenic psychic Brian Ladd dreams do come true. So, I'm not sure what to make of this, but I'm going to click on here. And see what we have. Uh, seems he has a whole channel. Mm -hmm. It's over 20,000 documented dreams. Mm -hmm. Predictions. A little bit of backstory on Brian. Uh, dream journals, it looks like. Hmm. Very interesting. It looks like one of these, I thought. I saw that he covered Madeline McCann. Hmm. Maybe not. Ooh. Didn't mean to scroll so fast there. But if we search. So. Glory. Pope. Let's see what happens.
Well, here it looks like it says, um, I'm not sure what that writing is called, but, you know. Hmm. It says, red signs, numbers, concrete pad. Interesting. Let's see if this one's any different. Not really. Okay, well, I just wanted to run through that because I just found it doing a little search on Reddit. So I would thought I 